Now your certified storm ready forecast from NBC 25. Well, it was a great day today in Saginaw, gray in Flint as well. Here's a live look at downtown Flint via NBC 25 Skycam. And to add insult to injury, it is breezy out there, but at least for now, Saginaw Street looking dry. That could change within the next 12 hours with some snow on the way. Right now, 40 degrees, so any snow that does fall initially, I think, might have a hard time sticking with the warm air temperatures today and the lingering warmer pavement. Wind chill 31. And it also feels cold in Saginaw. Feels like 30. The actual air temperature is 38. Overcast skies for you as well. And cloudy skies, the rule across the entire state and neighboring states. And here's that snow ahead of a cold front around Traverse City, back towards Grand Rapids and Muskegon. Behind the cold front, a little bit of lake effect or lake enhanced snow up in parts of the Upper Peninsula. And we could actually see some of that occur around here over the thumb as we head into tomorrow morning. At 11 p.m., the leading edge of the snow, I think, will be over the thumb and back through Aranac and Gladwin counties, and it'll quickly push to the south so that by 6.30 in the morning, right about the time many of you head off to work or school, we'll be getting some snow showers. This is looking a little bit more robust than what I think will actually fall, but still you get the idea that snow will be occurring early tomorrow morning, and it could be an inconvenience, so allow some extra time to get to where you need to go. At noon tomorrow, you can see the snow basically done with. By that point, it should be to the south of us. And then as we head through the rest of your Friday, it just looks cloudy heading into your Saturday at 8 a.m. We'll start out with clear to partly cloudy skies. These clouds might be overdone at 8 in the morning. And then as we head into the afternoon, it looks like lots of sunshine, but temperatures will stay cold both tomorrow and Saturday. Then we get a bit of a warm up as we head into Sunday and especially next week. Snowfall totals overnight, though. Our model going with a half to three quarters of an inch in most areas. I think that's overdone, probably a little bit more than what we'll really get across the Tri-Cities and Flint, more like a dusting in these areas. But as we head east of I-75 and especially up into Huron County, we could indeed see a half to three quarters of an inch because of that lake enhancement with the north wind. For tonight, 22 degrees, a chance of snow after midnight, breezy northwest to north winds 10 to 20. Tomorrow's high 31 and still kind of breezy out there. The snow should end right around noon or so. And then we'll look mostly cloudy for the rest of the day. We clear out on Friday night all the way down to 13, a low more typical of mid-January than late March. But the warming trend starts, well, even on Saturday to some extent. It'll still be cold with mid-30s, but mid-40s on Sunday, a chance of rain late Sunday. May briefly mix with a little snow, but shouldn't be a big deal by Monday morning. 50s by Wednesday and Thursday. Back to you.